Good morning. Today we're talking sheep tractors, specifically from the Sheep Tractor Company, sheeptractor.com in Waco, Texas. Sheeptractor.com. There's Coda. Look what showed up yesterday. This is our 16 by 16 sheep tractor. I want to give you the specifics of it. So it's a steel frame, four panels. It's got hog panels or pig panels that are welded in. All these joints are welded. Like I said, four panels that are held together by these bolts that just drop in. There you got one up top and one down low here. You got four airless tires. So it enables you to push to the pasture so you don't get a flat on a thorn tree, on a random nail. So 16 by 16, so it's 256 square feet. If you Google how much square footage a U requires, Google will tell you 15 square feet a day which means you could have 17 ewes in here. That'd be a tight fit for 17 ewes and I'm sure they'd eat the grass down to nothing. But it's gonna work great for our, our flock of four. Uh, we're actually gonna use this uh, to protect our ewes, our, our spe specifically our young ewe that Coda likes to pick on. And we actually got two of these and we're gonna separate out our ram so that we don't uh, end up having winter lambs. He's getting to that age where he's getting ready to start breeding and it's middle of August or towards the end of August and that puts us right dead center in uh, I believe January so we don't need that it does have a shade component here it's got five spikes that st uh, uh, stick out about eight inches and those are just PVC pipe that kind of pr provide an arc and this is some some shade cloth um, Time will tell how well this holds up I'm not sure how well that's gonna hold up in a in a heavy wind it does provide great shade it won't stop water from penetrating through, so uh, not going to keep anyone dry. So there may be a better product. Might be a, a tarp would work better. Um, it does have these grommets, so you can zip tie it down to the structure for wind, so it's not flapping. That could cause some deterioration in the product. But real simple to put together. It took two of us about 10 minutes to put together. You just stand the panels up, uh, put these bolts in, Two on each corner and then each corner has a has a brace that just kind of gets gets hung in here or gets uh get gets um attached like that and voila 10 minutes with two of you it might take 20 minutes if you're by yourself um a, a tip is if you are by yourself start with this panel right here you're able to stand this panel up by opening the door and letting it lean back on the door so that'll hold that panel up while you attach the other panels but really excited to see how this works, helps, helps us control our grazing as we can push it through our pasture. What I will probably do is move it twice a day just to make sure that we're not overgrazing and making sure that the sheep are not um, taking it down to, to nothing. That'll also help on the parasite load. The closer they eat to the ground, the more likely they are to ingest parasites. So sheeptractor.com out of Waco, Texas is the sheep tractor company where we, we got this. and. Looking forward to trying it out. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a blessed day. Feel free to subscribe and hit the like button. And you can always check us out at carterjamesranch.com. We do need to start updating our, our page. As of now, we're, we're only selling eggs. We were selling some pasture-raised chicken, but we're all, all out of that. In 2023, we're going to have grass-finished beef. And we'll have some lambs next year for sale. So the adventure continues. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day.